Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley B. Deck. Thank you so much for tuning in. So today we're going to be doing a lace wig install courtesy of West Face. They sent over this beautiful lace front wig. It is a free part so you have so much lace coverage in the inside construction of the cap which you'll see in just a moment. It also was a beautiful like silky straight long wig and you'll see all of the details and specs like literally straight out of the box. At the end I did go ahead and add some curls to it so you can see how beautifully I curled this one with no product at all. Now of course I did add a little hairspray. I did go with big sexy hair like the very 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 end. But for the actual curl this one is straight but it definitely holds a curl beautifully. So I'm not going to hold you guys. I'm going to go ahead and jump into the tutorial. Be sure to check this wig out. I have it directly linked in the description box. Hopefully you guys will enjoy the tutorial and without further ado let's go ahead and get started let's get started <laughs> Okay, my loves, this is the packaging from West Face. Absolutely gorgeous. I love the pink and gold collab. And then this is our box. I'll show you the goodies that they provided at the end of the video. This is our wig here. This is a 24 inch HD lace wig. I believe this one is 13 by 6 in cap construction. I'm going to go ahead and cut off that excess lace around um, the back or nape of the wig. And I'm going to remove the tag that was attached. And we're going to use the adjustable elastic band that is attached to the wig to go ahead and anchor her on and put the whole wig on so here's the parting space as i mentioned this one is six inches in parting space is giving like way more than that i love how long and beautiful and full this one is i also love the color it's not giving like shaggy you know that shaggy brown it's giving that nice rich brown if you're someone who likes your wigs dyed jet black this is one you can get away with like wearing straight out of the box and not feeling the need to dye it before you wear it and still giving like a nice rich color so for starters let's go ahead and cut off the excess lace around the ear if you are cutting this off understand that it may be like more or less for the next person that need will need to be cut off so this isn't like a customizing thing it's not a one size fits all thing and that's why they give you a little extra on the side so that if you have a wider head you don't have to complain about the wig being too short or too tight now I'm going to go ahead and pull the hair back and we are going to do our dynamic duo along the center part. Now one thing I will say about this one is it has a lot of body. If I can go back I probably would wash it and give it a fresh blowout to start fresh um, because it was kind of um, hard to kind of mold it without using too much product. So I did go ahead and take advantage of my wax stick and I got really heavy handed and it did end up a little bit greasy which you'll see in the end. If you don't know it's greasy like because I told you you know but if I didn't tell you you wouldn't know also with this one I highly recommend or I personally would do baby hair I chose to not do baby hair on this particular day just to give you guys something a little bit different because I know you get tired of the baby hair but I personally am a baby hair girl so of course I felt like I was missing out on my little two swoops um but yeah it's an option to not do so it gives a very like Naomi Naomi Campbell like supermodel Tyra Banks vibe to me Especially when you don't do the baby hair with this wig. It's like that nice, healthy, bust down middle part, jet black situation. And I, again, it gives supermodel vibes to me. But you guys know, I'm a little bit hood with it. So I want to mix in a little swoops here and there. But I think it came out beautiful nonetheless. While I am bumping my gums, I am also bonding the wig down. I did remove the rest of the excess lace just as you normally would. And that was super simple and easy. And now I am using a glueless adhesive to go ahead and bond it down on a cool setting once I was done with that from ear to ear I did go in with the ruby kisses cream foundation and I applied this generously to the parting space I also feel like you could have like straightened out the parting a little bit more I love to critique myself when I watch my videos back because there's a lot of times where you will execute a look and you think you just look like that girl and then when you come back a couple days later you can kind of look back and just give yourself personal critiques on what you could have done differently or better and again i would have done baby hair personally because i'm you know i like to channel the little model vibes and again when you do bust down middle part super dark hair long straight it gives supermodel vibes so that is very classy in a sense like this with a little sundress and some hermes sandals is definitely a vibe especially in this heat look how full and rich and just healthy this wig is i feel like when you silk press it it just gives a vibe and i'm proud of it like a little bottega bag you got to have like the Hermes on you got to have your wedding band on like the girlies who don't got a wedding band get you a Cartier love ring this one gives elevated classy 
in my opinion because it was such a simple and easy install it did go in and um, just add a little bit of body to the ends by just curling the ends now if you really want to curl the wig and just have real 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 curls you'd use a traditional curling iron smaller sections and go higher up with your curling iron but this is one of those like um oot or odes to like back in the day when i would be ready to go out i never would take the time to just curl my entire head i would just always do a quick one two at the ends like so with the flat iron and be out the door after adding a little hairspray here this one here i thought like can go up a little bit higher and give a little bit more oomph and i think i did the second one too feel free to also like add layers because this one is so full and long you definitely can add layers and give more of an aliyah vibe you can also make it like a side part like Aaliyah so there's definitely plenty of options but this was the result of doing both sides the second side I did do off camera she's absolutely gorgeous I just added a little bit of hairspray to make sure the curls didn't drop too quick and that was it so be sure to check this one out there is a direct link in the description box okay ladies so we are done with the look now I will call myself out and say one mistake that I made have um, you guys seen or I don't know if I'm going to keep the clip in but I did the dynamic duo up here and then I came here and did it again to straighten this out and I got it a little bit too oily now the easy the good thing is is that it's an easy fix you literally can just fix it with a little dry shampoo but I currently have dry shampoo um, in my cart on Sephora because I want to try the Amika one or the one by Amika but I haven't checked out so I don't have any dry shampoo on hand so we're gonna have to just make it rock now i will say that um with this one i wanted it to come like forward but you guys know i like to lift mine and give it a little height add a little baby here and that's more my style so i definitely wanted to step out of my comfort zone and just do like bust down middle part no hairline showing and just see how that looks on me and to be honest i think that i do prefer my hair when i go ahead and just um lift it like i almost rather see the lace than to not see the lace if that makes any sense like this and then to just take some powder and to um make sure that that is taken care of as far as like making sure everything blends of course it will look even better if I go ahead and pull some hair forward because you guys know I'm a baby hair girl but I'm not quite sure if I want to keep it like this because again I was just going for the flat in the front look so I'm just trying to figure out what my comfort zone is but while I figure that out in the meantime in the in between time this is a gorgeous wig from West Face and this is their beautiful packaging here and it just says West Face 100% human hair wig luxury I definitely think this one is a very 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 nice luxury wig my cousin's sweet 16 party is tomorrow so I will be wearing this beauty to her party tomorrow night it's like a night teen party but I still have to go um, you know take her her gift and say happy birthday this is the goodies that are inside and they did give these two like pastel colored um, scrunchies which we are here for um, and hopefully my daughters don't take them um, a pack of lashes and these are really nice they're really nice 3d but they're not too thin and they're not too like chunky um, they're very beautiful actually and then a pack of wig caps and these are two high quality wig caps and then also they did give the melt belt which says West Face all over it and then last but certainly not least they did give us a really nice pink robe so you know we're always here for the free goodies I'm definitely here for that as far as the hair goes I have no complaints I love the hair I love the density I love the fullness I love the length I love how nice and healthy like jet black it is and as you guys can see she holds a curl absolutely beautifully even before I added um, a holding spray like once I did the curl with no product and then I um, you know like pulled the curls apart or combed it out you can see how beautiful it was but I did add the big sexy here at the end just to kind of give it a hold so I don't have to touch the curls up love 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 this one this one be perfect to flexi rod the end so that tomorrow I, I can take it off tonight and then tomorrow um 
when it's time to get ready for my cousin's party I can just put it on and it already has this flexi rod so I don't have to touch up any curls in fact I think I'm definitely gonna do that um yeah and I have no complaints so you guys already know there's a direct direct link to this wig in the description box all details will be there um stay tuned follow me on Instagram because I probably will be flicking it up and I probably will have ha added some baby hair which you guys know is my jam thank you guys so much for watching and as always I'll see you in the next one smooches